What's good, everybody? Welcome back. Today, I'm going to be talking about mantis shrimps. And right now, you're looking at my mantis shrimp. He is absolutely beautiful. But what I don't think everyone knows is that there are other dope kinds of mantis shrimp other than peacock mantis shrimp. And so today, I have got a list of some of the coolest ones. And, you know, let's get right into it. Okay, so the first mantis shrimp on the list is the yellow mantis shrimp. It's also called the Pseudosquilla Kiliata. These guys are actually a spearing mantis shrimp. They get about four to five inches, which is a really good length. And in this video, this guy has a beautiful one. They come in yellow and they also come in orange, but their colors can change based on when they're a juvenile versus an adult. So that's something you have to look out for. But these guys would work really well in a reef tank if you're not worried about fish going missing. Uh, or you could have them in a species only tank, kind of like a, how I have mine. Uh, this guy chooses to have his in a reef tank and it looks great. Uh, I love this video. It's one of my favorite videos of mantis shrimps in general. The next mantis shrimp on the list is the Japanese mantis shrimp, well, also known as the Odontodactylus japanicus. And this mantis shrimp is insane looking. It has like these matte chrome colors. It's like white and pink. And it can get about 7 inches. It's a smashing type mantis. Uh, you want a 30 gallon minimum for it. And it can take temperatures 72 to 80 degrees. Also I have this crazy video of a peacock mantis shrimp breeding with a Japanese mantis shrimp. And I mean, I don't know what to say about this video. I just thought I should show you guys. Okay, so the next mantis shrimp is one that you might be able to get your hands on a lot easier than the ones mentioned before. It's the Gonadactyliaceous Gona, Gona uh, turnitensis. Sorry, I could not say the first word. It's really hard to pronounce some of these guys' names. This is also called the orange spot mantis shrimp and it gets five inches which is a great length for a mantis shrimp it's a smasher i would say 20 gallons minimum tank size and it'll take a temperature of 76 to 82. this one is also very bold and it's known for having really good live feedings just like this video from mantis man the next mantis shrimp on the list is the purple spotted mantis shrimp aka gonadactylus smithy and guys i know on the last pronunciation i got it just horribly wrong and you guys are probably like this guy doesn't know what the hell he's talking about but i promise i actually do i know a lot about mantis shrimps i've done my research some of these guys names are actually just hard to pronounce but back onto the mantis shrimp this guy is a small mantis shrimp He's only gonna grow to about 3.5 inches and he's a smasher, which means you can have a lot of fun with him. He can take on hermit crabs, smaller type crabs, and you can also keep him in a tank as small as 10 gallons. Uh, I would recommend temperature 76 to 80 degrees. And yeah, these guys are pretty active and easy to take care of. So I would highly recommend the Smithy Mantis Shrimp. The fifth and final mantis shrimp on the list is the zebra mantis shrimp or the bumblebee mantis shrimp and its real name is the Lysiosquilina maculata now this mantis shrimp is pretty insane it's 12 to 14 inches but i've heard of them getting up to 20 inches in the wild these things get absolutely massive they live in the sand bed so you need a deep substrate bed so they can burrow inside it and they will actually come up and kill fish. They will stab them and eat them. These guys are insane. Definitely one of the best mantis shrimps out there. I would love to keep one. And I know you can buy them pretty easily. So if you guys want to get one, you can definitely look into doing so. And yeah, guys, that's the video. Psych, it's bonus mantis shrimp time. And the bonus mantis shrimp today is the Pseudosquilana. Richeri. Now, this name is a little bit weird, but this mantis shrimp is pretty dope. It's bright red, 
and it's extremely rare. I was able to find this one clip of it. Uh, if you look, it has these spiky things on it, which make it pretty cool looking. I don't think I've ever seen a mantis shrimp with that on its armored shell. And that's probably a pretty good defense against predators too. Uh, you can find these guys in the Red Sea, and they're red. Probably has nothing to do with each other, but they are both red. And uh, you guys got to beware with this one because it can break your corals. They are known to do that. And uh, yeah, if you're able to land your hands on one of these rare ones, I commend you, my guy. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a lot of fun to make. Oh yeah, also, we got 1K subs. You guys are the best. Thank you so much. I'm going to do a 1K special soon. But uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.